right, so the guitar is tuned down a half step. So that's the first thing we gotta do. Okay, so check this out. We're gonna go, which is just um, the eight and the seven on the high E. And then this note again, up a whole step. Back to that one, so check it out. So everything on that high E so far, I'm gonna go from the, th the fifth fret, slid up to the seventh on that last move, so it looks like this. Then a G note right there, which is the uh, eighth fret of the B. So, so far. Then that motif starts again. Same thing, a real kind of subtle note right there, which is the seventh. And then from the 10 to the 12 slide. So that whole thing now. That motif again. That exact same thing, but then we have to go like this. So that's 10 to 8 on the B, and you can switch your fingers, okay? Another time right before so that's gonna be a 12, from 10 to 12 on the high E. So you've got that 12 slide and then two times on the high E on the 10th fret. And then you need this little lick. lick. And so that's gonna be a 12 to 14 slide back. To the root, or well, to the 10th fret of the high E. And then 12 on the B back to 10 on the high E. So we're making it through kind of nice, so I'm, I'll, I'll do it kind of robotic so you can pick out all the notes. All right, the next lick is pretty hard for an acoustic guitar, some of the bending. Um, so I assume he had pretty light strings and also tuning down a half step helps as well. Um, but basically we're gonna take this G string on the uh, seventh fret. We're gonna just try and bend it up. Then we're gonna go to the fifth on the B. Then we go eight on the B. So we have to do a bend again, back down, and then five, seven. So check out that lick.
So we're rocking. Now it's basically the same lick, but on the second fret of the, of the G. So we have to bend, then open B to third on the B. Then check it out. little sequence again but then our ring finger is going to be on the seven and we're going to slide it from the seven to the nine and then index finger on to the eight of the B so it's a little finger transition and that's kind of a bluesy thing so we got the ten on the B to eight to nine on the G so check this out. We're almost done pretty much. So we got Okay, so we just work a little thing between the eight and the 10 of the B after that lick. So we've got, so that's a eight, 10, and then a bend. That's the phrase, more or less. It's pretty, it's pretty close. Just a little thing right there. That's it. Okay, and then we've got, which is gonna just be three, five, back and forth on the B. And then I'm playing it this way. So it's a pull off from four to two on the G, and then three hammered to four. So. Then second on the G. And then you just play the open D or the pinky on the D right there. It's a good lick for a D chord. <laughs> 